obviously, we are huge fans on Thank Clever you. TV of you, State of Georgia. So kind of catch us up as to what's going on in the show right now. Well, right now, um, the show that we're going to be seeing on Wednesday, actually, Georgia has a friend come from, you know, Atlanta, and it's her friend of me. And she goes to this whole kit and caboodle and trying to get Jason Derulo tickets. Ultimately, at the end, Jason Derulo comes to my house and I'm still in a chicken suit. I don't know how from that got to there, but you gotta watch the show and you can fill in the blanks. Such a cool co star. Yeah. That's so exciting. Who would be like your dream guest star to have on the show? Oh my goodness, there's so many people out there that can give me so much of each moment that I can't even <laughs> tell you anyone in particular. I actually got to meet him last night at the Teen Choice Awards and I know you were there I and I loved your outfit Thank and you. I love how you play with fashion. Um, what do you think about before you're getting ready for a big event, even like even like something like today? I hope my button doesn't pop because this thing is tight. <laughs> The secret, the secret, the secrets that no one knows, you know? I hope I don't fall because my back is hurt. <laughs> yeah, but you smile the whole entire time and look nice. I hope my weave is tight because this thing is about to fall out. I mean, like, can you just be honest? From, Let's what do you be think honest. about when you go on the carpet? The I honesty, don't. I'm don't never, I'm always on the other side. So. Yeah, but you still have to get ready. Kind of. What but do you I'm think about like, when you're getting ready as a girl? Well, that's weird, but you know what I mean. I know what you mean. Yeah, I hope I'm comfortable. That's like always the number one thing. But are you? Hardly ever. Exactly. Let's face it. Let's say I'm comfortable to bed. You look really cute. Thank you. Um, so just to get back to the show, <laughs> Sorry. Um, of course, since that's why we're here, I could talk about fashion all day. Um, half hour comedy, which I think is so cool on ABC Family, where there's so much drama going down all the time. Um, why was this something that you wanted to do, comedy? In I was born in comedy. Yeah. It scares me to have to do anything else. <laughs> I'll be honest, I love comedy. Um, I will do drama eventually maybe in my life, but right now I don't think I'm emotionally stable enough to do that. And um, why not do a comedy with Loretta Devine and Mahandra Delfino and the people and the writers and all of the crew? Like they make the environment so wonderful. And how did you and Mahandra develop your chemistry? Because I have no idea. Yeah. I honestly, I hate to. just instant? Instamatic, like hipstamatic on your iPhone. Like it was <laughs> right then and there. And it's funny because I'm like, I just had a co-star from That's So Raven. Uh -huh. I'm like, I don't want to make a new best friend. Like, I had her for five years. And then I meet her, I'm like, you're awesome, dude, let's go in. And then we, we had like a dinner with her husband and my friend and myself and her, and we just bonded we inseparable. immediately. Like, I still call her, braid your hair. We have to go to work. She's like, no, we're not. The second season isn't yet. I'm like, it's OK, braid it. Second season get picked up soon, let's hope. <laughs> Yeah, so what would you like to see happen with your character coming down the pipeline and like the acting and everything that she's pursuing career-wise? I would love to see her in more roles. I would love to see her get into more high-stakes situations. I would love to see just a crack of the whip and then just let me go crazy. <laughs> what would you, Raven, give as far as advice goes to your character, to Georgia? I would tell her to sit down for a second because she's a little up in everybody's business and making that business about hers and she's not concentrating enough on herself in another type of sense. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. There's two different ways to pay attention to yourself, the good way and the bad way. And she sometimes gets caught up in the bad way. So I would just tell her, listen, it's hard work out there. Keep up your craft and you'll eventually make it, but watch your attitude. And I think that you are someone who could definitely give great advice to so many stars out there who are trying to kind of segue from the team market, you know. I'm still segueing. I have no yeah. advice. It is a very difficult What's that been one. like for you? It's very interesting because I'm 25 and mm -hmm. I play a character that's 25, but for the rest of my life I'll have reruns of episodes of every age bracket and when you grow up in front of people they treat you like a sibling and you don't want your little sibling to ever grow up. So it's having to pick roles that gradually help to pacify other people being okay with me growing up. Yeah, baby steps. Baby kind steps. Of all along the way. What about music? Any chance that you're going to be releasing anything? I'm always doing music because I'm always writing and I'm always thinking. Um, as soon as I figure out what's going to happen with the show, then I'll start working on my album. I worked on it before and then I got the show and I stopped because I always give 127,000%. And then after that, I started getting to steal a little bit. But we'll have to see what happens with the show. Very cool. Well, congratulations. Maybe you and Jason Derulo collaboration. Who knows? I'm just Who knows? We have different types of music because that never stopped anybody. No, not at all. Well, it's nice to finally meet you. Nice to finally I feel like meet this you has been well. a long time. We it has. Good to see you. Take all. care.